exactly what they wanted, right? They wanted to try and play retake five players alive. Well, they knew it was a possibility, right? That's what, you know, doubling up on Beheaven the way that they were, they knew that this might come down to this and some should they have something prepared. It's like, actually falls over Harry, so they don't detect him under Heaven, but they still trade him. Yeah, it takes a few too many bullets to find that first kill, so he couldn't find the second. Fortunately, one enemy remains. We're narrating the rest of the squad. I mean, everybody doing their part here in this one. They stay and fight on the site. Nobody off of it. Mad Lions find themselves three players in lead here in the pistol round. Shazam, though, making it hurt on the way back in. But Bjor will close the book for the util back and forth. And oh, as the dust settles, it's oh yeah, go ahead. Uh, I think that only while underneath the strap wire, when you hit crouch, it should look like you're doing the limbo. Riot, get on it. Okay, I like that. Just, nice little... Only for those interactions. A normal crouch, otherwise. Yeah, nice little animation change there. That'd be interesting. As uh, we get one enemy remaining. The sights set now on this B side. It didn't work out for day three. Couldn't get a whole lot done. The rest of the team looking to pick up the pieces across the map and unable to do so. So that lesser buy on this map throughout really the whole challenger season this year. Ooh, nice early kill there, Dapper. Dealt with Nary. Gonna find another. I was gonna say a little bit quiet here from the jet from Mad Lions, but break through the defense just a bit. Penny. And reassume that position and there it was not. G2 decided to snap on the side range. Broke it. Also getting pushed out here over at screens by a star as G2 start working their way in. Running out of time. And Trick finds a big friend. One enemy remaining. A yeah, big first kill inch there for the next. And now these trades, unfortunately, not in favor of G2 as Buell will finally make good on this position. Knife out. Just trying to be festive and fun, but. Bjor won't allow it. The team ace of B have been. If this utility subsides, they'll be able to do so. But Dapper's still holding it down back. Like Crapwire dealt with. Nere gonna come through now. Flashes are there. Dapper's still alive. Eventually, the trade comes through, but quick on the retake here is Oxy as he works his way back into the site. Finds the first, tries to spray down the next, but trick too good for it. Whippy on the back step. No way. Viper pit used here. Ainge to be left on an island, but he does. Yeah, it's not this looking too good for Whippy. He does have one star available. So you can maybe use that to try to isolate something, but he's going into the abyss One right now. Remaining. Gets the first frag, but Ainge quick to retaliate. Mad Lion on it nicely. They don't really have to change up too much at all here, although they did lose take one of their out. big controllers on the speed split. Start from G2, they go hunting for oh, the player boy. that should be solo, but Trick still manages to do it. Opens up the B site, the defender's gone. Two more here to worry about as Dapper gets around the pillar. A little disconnected inside B main is the rest of this Mad Lions roster. And B3, but it's still very doable. Spike planted. As he gets spotted, wall bingable here. Shazam gives up the angle. Two more just around the corner. Cam is up. Oof. But they have the re, but they don't quite have the kills. Three. For Trick, one in response for Dapper. Now it's all up to Blackheart. One enemy Who sits on a flash, has the backstab now in a 1v1. I mean, you couldn't ask for anything better. Flashed up is Shazam. We'll trade back for another. Halfway, the spike will go. Will Shazam look to stick it all the way? Yeah, he's going to do just that. Blackheart won't call the bluff because he's not bluffing. And G2 find a way to get it done. Yeah. Alt advantage here with the res. Both showstoppers are in play here. Oh, and yes, yes, they are both in play. And they they both find value. Trick gets his. Oxy battles back for one of his own. Fortunately for G2, they've got another Whippy. Straight up the kills. Now spots a few more. There's the spike. Blackheart falls around the corner. The bullet dog starts to bark. It starts to bite. It's Whippy for four. Love Whippy's trigger discipline there. Trick once again. Up to his usual shenanigans of trying to pressure mid, but he is going to get spotted by Oxy, and that's a beautiful wow. utility combo. Oxy getting a frag at all there was pretty nuts. I've got your I think Trick getting a little crazy was pretty nuts. As we go Cosmic Divide for Cosmic Divide. Flash around the corner. Will catch his teammate, unfortunately, as Bjor. Only going to bring up the rear, expecting the push through. Shazam couldn't find the shot, so Bjor will punish him for it. Neural Theft comes through. Both defenders... Could have information, but is that going to be enough? 2v4, remains. Ainge on the backstab. Dap now the last one standing, and he's got so much to get done. The double swing comes out, and Bjor will have himself around here. The knives for now. Short in hand, not going to find too much. Dapper can't make good on his utility. Blackheart gets rid of the tag. Shazam will fall eventually to the blades, and 
D2 again find themselves a player down in a position where they're retaking, and it does not look the best. Two stingers. Shorty. Now a showstopper to come on through. Ainge tried to sneak away. Couldn't do so. Dapper there on the trade, but the knives are back to narrate. Picks up two for the round. <laughs> Thought he found an upgrade. Not quite what he was hoping for. Now it's all up to the stingers here. G2 looking for a fifth round. But working against so much. Shorty in hand. Dash available. Both players around the corner. First one's gone. Make it to narrate for four mad lines for eight. Man, they're really struggling to figure out what did narrate buy for 800 credits with just a shorty and a cloud. Oops. Must have grabbed something else for the team. Well, okay, and the shorty's getting the reinvestment right there. Ainge there to back him up. Make One oh, enemy God, remaining. Get the shorty out of this guy's hands. That's tough. That is tough. You just ran straight into the blender. Flawless. Wow. We talked about importance and that. See, taking some good space here. So opening up a nice B split for G2 to fight back against the bonus of the opposition. Only one player left. still here. That's Fior and does grab one, but would be quick to trade it. Very efficient. Should be it. Yeah, Dapper, not even really a one. Some revision there. A weapon now picked up from Narraden. Again, ended hot, started hot. Can he keep it going here? Flashes out all three drop down. Oxy. They're on the site, working hand-in-hand hand with Penny. Whippy on the cross. Penny gonna find the first. Now down to two here for Mad Lions. G2. They'll grab their first attacking round. Ainge can't quite find the kill. Neither can Blackheart and G2 have done it. They hang on here. Option for mid to late round. And so this is pretty Scout standard from G2. It. Nothing really, you know, leaping off the page. Never pulls off that lurk early, though. Oh, man, that is tough. And Narrate, I mean, has a red carpet laid for him to get out. Dashes through, the wall goes up. No chance to run him down. Makes it out. Operator still in hand. Knives available as well. You're expecting something out towards minute. It was that Dapper, who gave up on the lurk out towards eight early in this round, tried to make good on it out towards mid. And unfortunately, that falls short as well. Yeah, they needed that, Fry. That would have got him back into a four on four and would have created that danger to split up the defense. As it stands, though, it's going to be a five on three. They can keep a firm B defense in place. They still have a pretty well handled. Mm. And now, from bad to worse here for G2. Port here from Trick. 30 seconds left. One enemy remaining. Spike I was going to say, a direct 2v2 a. here. How much do you walk away with if you're G2 and you do eventually get that sight? Not even the case, so. Nope. And he goes down. Whippy. All in his lonesome. No time, no teammates, no spike. Ten seconds left. And maybe even no rifle here. No chance to save. Another flawless round. From okay, uncharacteristic miss there. There he thinks the first shot won't land it. Tries to get the second. Good utility from Oxy, but some in response will force you two back. And I mean, just when you think G2 finally gets some breathing room, the, the breath is stripped right away from him. Yeah, Rams control taken right away back from Mad Lions. So they will just double back and focus on the Ahab and drop down. Trick getting over the top of everyone, but a good remaining. response from Oxy. That's huge from him. And that's it. Wow. It. That was a uh, very 8 to 11 score line, and things get interesting all of a sudden. Oh, your timing. Ugh. Down B. Hey, good trade zone, right? Whippy being there, right place, right time. Unfortunately for Oxy, nobody trade him there. Here comes that showstopper looking for Dapper and will find him some way, somehow. Trick makes it work. You both don't want to be inside main, especially with three players pushing this way. You two can find the first onto Blackheart. If they can get something done, Mad Lion's taking quite a bit of time, work their way back into the uh, Whippy finally gonna get spotted. Trick will eventually find that kill, and if he didn't. There were two more behind him as Blackheart drops down. Shazam to try and hang on, do his darndest, but he swings out to three players. Again, just when G2 starts. And to make all things right in the world, Oxy should be able to just show stock for the ground anywhere and find a kill. It should just be for free. Beautiful flash, dash away, narrate plays that perfectly. G2 want to stomp their way onto this site. Blackheart to push through. Grab the well, keeps him at bay for now. Resurrection uses Penny, try to make good with it. It's down to the last two. Whippy wants to fight back. Oxy now tries to hang on, but he cannot do so inside the smoky falls. And Mad Lions get a huge really lock in the playoffs. I mean, I'm sure they're going to have it no matter what, but you don't want to finish this way, is my point. As they're trying to play a little bit of a bait and switch here at Art with Oxy hiding behind the box. And there is the trap, but equal trades. Mad Lions happy with that. 
and not even necessarily ready for it, but responding to it. Our Mad Lions with here to find the first on the One next. Three remains. kills, make it four. Trick just does not stop. Bay finds the tag. Trick down to 22 HP. And and just gonna toy with them a little bit. Not even getting halfway. Dapper, remaining. I think, was expected to get that one a bit further. Now let's go back to it. A full diffuse is what it'll take. And Ainge knows just that. Gonna play with the time. Dapper just has none of it. The yeah. shots are there. It, sure, give him the kill, but the round, it belongs to Mad Lions. Yeah, this equal trades through Art against that bait and switched out that G and little baby Yoda Yeah, thing. the green little. Yeah, the little baby. I stopped watching after the first season. Oh uh, I'm out. Ooh. A lot of your information. They know Oxy's here. They can't find the kill. Narrate falls. Trick follows. Oxy going to right all the wrongs of that last map. Hope comes down. We're just going to hop on the defuse. Nobody even trying to play, spray this one through there. Hope. Oh my god. Whoa. Yes, they do. Blackheart gets two. As Penny goes aggressive here. The defuser killed. Blackheart eventually falls. The spike halfway. So plenty of. Was a judge picked up there or was there no weapon? Roxy, either way. <laughs> The defense here on the B site. We can. Oh, okay. I mean, that's the best time to have a judge there. He goes for the swap. Unfortunately, it's just missed time. So, Whippy there for the trades on back. He goes for some more, but he runs into two. Penny to try and pick up the piece. I thought you was the pitcher. I don't remember. And all of this makes sense because there's a call out here on the A site called Dugout. Nobody there just yet. A player walking up from Secret, slowly trying to grab that position as Oxy. Finds a kill on the way back in, drops the operator. It's only a bulldog here. Here comes the hunter, Shuri, though. To make its way into the cove. Nobody home on top of that spike, but shots two and three to eventually come to fruition, but they need more behind. The gravity will pull Penny off. Now all G2 can hope for is kills on the way out. Economy always a problem here as Penny gets this one close. It'll come down to it, but a second and a half is what they're shot. This is exactly how Split started as well. G2 only got the bonus round after that four rounds in a row. Four Mad Lions. That's Oxy big. wandering out towards mid. Yeah, finding that kill onto Ainge, making that one hurt and also finding himself a weapon. They actually don't go pick up the weapon. And Oxy had that Vandal from the start. Oh. So they didn't actually go back and reclaim it. Now they are, but look at it, it's too late. Like Shazam's going to grab that fallen weapon and his whole team went down in the process. Resuming your termination. I wish they, they can't do it because of the suppression and the spike hadn't been planted yet. I, I definitely think there was there was time for G2 to take a bit One more and left. get set up. Blackheart not ready for the peak there. So we'll see what this picked up weapon does eventually. Oh, yeah. Get two players Blinded. around the corner. Trailblazer and another flash. They with here for Shazam. They line up and he's able to get one through the robot, but Trick survives. 18. There, don't really know about long though. They also don't know if they have fallen back potentially into a long B hit. So they're gonna have to respect that with a couple players in B lane. Wow. Speaking of respect, Oxy giving none of it to the utility of Mad Lions. This the round. side of the map. Like, while the B hit is slowed down by the lockdown, Oxy gets to take area. so much space and allow his teammates to rotate all four of the remaining members onto side to defend here. And Nerik gets home. Yeah, completely in no man's land here. Hunter Fury, though, looking to make good on a few. No way. The util is all it takes here. Is Oxy on the back line, shorty in the back pocket, and the knives go wide. A round that starts so good for G2 again falls apart. They crumble beneath the Mad Lion kill from downtown, right? And just, yeah. I think Blue somebody enemy. maybe, I didn't see who the kill was on, but maybe just sticking around too long, hoping somebody would peek behind it. And then eventually just getting cooked, much Ooh. like Narrate does this time around. Oxy doing it again, though, but it seems like the winning recipe is Oxy. If Oxy doesn't do it, it doesn't get done. So the rest... Yeah. Allowing his other teammates to kind of gather up and start pushing together. Again, Dapper just playing very intelligently right now. Just keeping tabs. But, oh, no. no. Last player standing. That's big. At least he got traded. And the last bit of utility. Trick to the look to go for the plant here. Will eventually get spammed down with 63 HP. He lives to fight the rest of this round. Two players work their way through a link. The first one's down. The second one, almost the third. But again, if Oxy don't do it, it don't get this pressure on B. They had the spy carrier here as well. And now Trick does come out. Oxy gets caught out in the middle. Dapper tries to play the bait off of it, but fails. And that's a wow. big kill from Trick. And they just want to kill the robot. They're sending so much out that way just to secure that kill and response. Penny does so 
successfully. Sure, the odds are even. Zam playing the jump peak. Lots of few players out towards B long, and this is where Mad Lions have liked to call home. This has been their den. That stinger gonna find some damage, but now out of ammo. Narrate on the back side will find the backstab. The headshots are there. Now it's all up to left. Dapper. He's on his lonesome. The cloud burst. He will go. Narrate just on the other side of it. Axe away momentarily. Ainge also a nuisance with util, cloud burst, bullets being sent this way. The tallest of tasks, the high low is there. Player crouch, and that's narrate to find the kill to close out the half. Especially when you're down a man. Oxy was spotted. Look at the health though. Already so incredibly low for the players working their way on. And Oxy is doing enough just buying time. He's also buying kills. 5 HP. This guy's a demon. He reloads. Well, eventually. He dealt with. And now we get to the utility, right? Oxy got to uh, One keep the credits remaining. high for the team for a moment longer. G2 will do it. They get that spike planted, and that's short out the defenders. Bucky and Anna close in personal. Oxy, no dash to play with now. That high tide's gonna be going down here momentarily. Need to be careful as Neri comes around the corner. Shotgun gets it done. Knives behind it. Two players already erased here. Mad Lion. Trick looks to bide his time. Inside the link, Oxy goes, but. And his job has already been done to before the retake even starts in order mm -hmm. to have success on this B side of the map. And so G2 can keep using their harbor utility and keep using Oxy as an entry point. Player just around the corner. Mad Lions, the rest of their vendors. Nobody can really get in to try and stall. A dash on through its narrate with the stinger. Shazam in the back lines. Fjord will find another. The IGL down. Dapper. It's a kill of their own, but much like we've seen previously, this post plant is a proficient one, a potent one yep. with the Nano Swarm still on it. Snake Bites, one available. These smokes, I mean, they're not gonna do the trick, right? You have to go forward. You have to take the fight for these players and they just can't do it. Penny lines Can. them all up, knocks them all down. Hong Kong will deal with that turret inside art. Back away, letting the paranoia set in. Yeah, but again, look, they have been able to get aim set up at long A. So he just basically, oh, that's big though. That's big from Dapper. That's a B link threat reckoning now on the side. But that's a great response from Nary, but it's not enough. Not if he's going to get traded that quickly. Now to three versus two. Blackheart, he fights back though as well. See the player here. He had some stars too if he heard that turret. Could maybe look to, to plop something down to allow himself on. I do like to play for Blackheart here, right? Just backing away from it, not looking to take 1v2. And as I say that, it walks back into the site, getting a little antsy is eventually dealt with now he has concealment the poison cloud down though so snake bite sure the spam is gonna be the next best tool here comes the snake bite dapper gonna play behind the turret find the kill doesn't matter man g2 have looked good here on the attack if you let him get the spike plant yeah oxy left as the deposit right now inside a main so he's waiting to see if anybody looks to reclaim this space Seekers go through, flash behind it, Oxy to take the first fight, it's tricked to fall. Ainge now just on the other side, no way, Oxy does it again, just opens things up on the A site, and this operator does not fury. With 30 seconds on the clock, not a whole lot of time to rotate here from G2. No, they have to commit to this. There's no doubt about it, but Sam finds the entry on the trick, they are able to respond though. Same with Blackheart, it's getting tricky. It, unfortunately, Bjor left. thought that maybe there was a chance across Spike the map. Planted. He still stands. Shots go wide. Blackheart Last left on an island. Standing. Two players going to try and run him down. And now Bjor will have I to fight said two players. Reckoning will give away the positioning. Ear of the Killjoy. Bjor dances around it. Picks up a rifle. 17 oh. bullets left in the magazine. Penny on the backside. And G2 do it again. They're gone. Water or G2, rising. they obviously have plenty more. Bjor... Soul Defender here, locked on in hand. You know Oxy's running this one down. Yeah, you absolutely know Oxy is running this one down, but he gets punished for it. Now the defense has to try and back away. No pushing forward instead. It's trick here. Indeed they are. Using the Cascade to kind of pave the way forward. Narrate though, playing a bit of a crossfire with his teammates between the back halls and the B-Link area. Spike will go down. Whippy gets taken down. Penny able to respond, but it's quickly traded back, and now it's all just Sam. 1v3, he's found one. Found one. Terrifying here. Trick out towards Law. <gasps> he found a headshot there. Shazam might be able to do this. A tap on the spike for Bjorn, and he'll eventually say no way. A lot yeah, of utility here. Unfortunately, Bjorn's not around to activate Poison. a lot of not it. Enough fuel. <laughs> but at least they have some Astra <laughs> Stars, and they got oh. this over. Blackheart with a crazy oh. angle. Almost finds two there. Dinks Whippy, I believe. Oh, 
And Trick just missed the timing there. Has the Fragment, though. So depending on where this plant goes, can look to deny. Cove comes out. Fragment in hand. He's going to right-click that one forward. Penny should be able to get this spike down, but does he make it out? Yes, he does. The Cove will keep him alive. Ooh. Flashes. Trick still alive. Dash into the special Shazam will finally close out that kill. The Judge comes through for two. And overtime is a possibility here. Two players to worry about. A Cosmic Divide. The push through from long range. Narrate finds a third. Judge Jury Executioner. Black Heart will continue the pressure here towards back halls. But Narrate is kind of the linchpin holding this lake area from Art's side. And Black oh, Heart with that frag is going to keep the fake up even more as his spike makes its way to A. G2 don't know where to go. This timing, though, could be awkward. Penny, you know, opt out. I mean, it's so hard to not jump up into that window, but Penny doesn't do it. Narrate will eventually get punished. Penny going to find his way into another frag for G2 as Dapper. Flops down his turret. That now gone. That bit of utility not available. Any low HP. Dapper pushing up. Angel deal with him. It's all up to Harbor here, and Angel's not having any of it. Mad Lions. Now, G2 were... They gotta get going. We'll see if Bjork can just scoop high. Yeah, that smoke just dissipated. Now here on the side, it's only Blackheart Ainge. Gonna be backing him up. Spike G2 wanna go back and fight this one here. Whippy first up. Trick the first to fall. Whippy grabs two before finally going down. Bjork only good for one. Now it's all up to Blackheart and Ainge. Revealed by the alarm bot Oxy still in the back lines. This guy not one needed off remaining. the site to play the post plan. He's gonna stay here and try and fight as Ainge goes inside oh, the astral form. He'll be dealt with and G2 send us into another OT. Again, I like it here. A little bit pop. Snake fight also comes down. Four defenders for G2. We're here on this angle. Now back away momentarily. Nano Swarm keeps him off the angle. Trick now gonna look to go aggressive. No. Running and gunning though. Oxy gets one. The shorty comes out for another. Shazam looks to clear his way through. They lost too much, I feel like, there. Yeah, they're gonna get the spike down, but unless Ainge can find the most beautiful timing ever. And no, Whippy catches him. That should be it. This is a very tall ask here. If you were to grab the first, another one just around the corner, but eventually it dealt with. It was black card. Now it's all up to Bjora. 1v2. First Nano Swarm popped. High Tide goes out. Both players just on the other side. Cove comes down. Off comes the Harbor. And there was a moment where you thought maybe the kill will come through. Shouldn't do G2. Expect this when Flash comes out. We'll get him off the angle for just a second. Cascade is there. Dapper. How much does he give up here? Only needs to spot the head, but look at the aggression from Oxy. Shot does not land. Dapper sits him down. Trick to try and get it back, but Dapper just too good here in this next round. Yeah, and this could be the beginning of the end here for this map. It could be a map three now, right around the corner. G2 can finish things off. Sam certainly putting it in that direction, but Bjor trying to fight back. Aang still needs to make his rotation. Bjor overwhelmed, and that that should be it unless Aang can come up big with the clutch. Spike planted. You should run. Dapper on the plant. Lockdown. Back holes here. He's going to try and take some points aggressively. He's already been spotted. I believe Dapper on the jump. He flash comes through. First one there is Whippy and G2 Attackers eventually get it done win. from 9 to 3 to a 15 to 13. Teleport out. Stim behind it. Shazam still here. We'll back away from it. Smokes are down. Looking oh, like an beautiful. A hit here, but Oxy finds the first kill, neutralizes Narrate for now with that. Mad Lions completely stopped in their tracks. They'll try and play oh, the cross, and this is a larger doorway to play with. Not a big enough enemy remaining. angle and oh, showers, my. though, to get away from the paint shells. And Oxy has had himself a field day from 40 kills into the last just about. He finds three more in the have in the post. They have one snake bite. Boom bot. See if they choose to use it. Good flash up the top for Frick. Ainge once more gonna try and take the fight. Wins that one out. Angela pop goes Oxy. Paint shells just over and I mean G2 run out of time. They want to find these kills. They're gonna have to do so now. A classic across the map here. Bjorn uh -oh. does it again. Shazam gets sat down. No incendiary to force him off. No way. No way. Bjorn with the classic. Name a better duo. It's all up to Oxy. And Bjorn does it for fight up a fake. With the U-Haul, Orbital Strike, and a push out hookah. Toxins going up. Mm, they didn't really sell it. Fortunately, left. the incendiary finds that kill onto Whippy, but that was one of two defenders that were here on the site. Dapper finds it Ooh. onto Trick, and Shazam gets dealt with. They are sitting in the Cove there to try to shield the fuse. Been broken already, though. 
One enemy remains. And the Yuto kind of working against them, right? They don't know where these shots are coming from. This Viper screen is here. The Toxic screen. The high Tide just on the other side. Penny to try and fight for some of these kills. Ball goes down. There's no time on the clock. Bjorn will find the kill either way. Working back on this pair here. Viper's pick going to go down as well for a post plant. Headshot. And now Bjorn looking to try to mop up the rest of this. No dodges. Dust holding down to the fort just as this Viper's pit is looking to do. Oxy going to work his way through. Penny for some fights. Whippy here. Narrate gets one back. Spike. And Tanner's gone, so his mic said no. As we are back into the heat of this, Nary with the great frag there with the show stopper stopping that diffuse from going through, and Penny now has no choice but to just back off and save. And so Mad Lions with another dominant start to an attacking half. We've seen this. As Bjor will find the entry frag here. And this was a buyback round from G2, which is Sam almost getting caught there. A little down the half, and he can't heal himself. Great catch, though, for Penny on to Narrate. As well as a double up there onto Bjorn. Trick eventually able to trade. Ainge finds Shazam. So it's going to be a three on two for Mad Lion despite some early hiccups. Napper making that rotation into Hookah. They're going to respond by teleporting over to A side to get away from this rotation. Rez, though, will now be available for Whippy because the attacking side has rotated off the site. Now, Ainge has been left behind, though. And so Ainge can cut off this rotation, and indeed he does find Whippy, and so he gets it back to a three on two post. Is, is oh you. boy. It's not a Tanner problem, because this happened to Shift, too. This only happened twice, all split, and both times they were casting with you. I think you got toxic internet, dog. One enemy remaining. I don't know, man. All I know is that Mad Lions are out here riding Pittsburgh Knights. <laughs> The big opener for Mad Lions is a sentence we've said a couple times already here in this first half, and it looks like they're going to find more out of this. No, Oxy actually gets to pick up on the trick. There's a follow-up from Narrate, though. The late plant coming in from Mad Lions, but control fans through. They're not going to find anything just yet, but they got the lineups, dog. Yep, all Nothing the lineups. You can do. Nope. All the Canary getting around remaining. the corner as well. Insult to injury. 8-1, Mad Lions. I mean, they are... But now, they're the, turning it around this I've match. Like that's for sure. The changes they made, I wasn't even sure what to expect out of this roster, but it's clearly working out for them, and sometimes it's a little bit of luck. Truck just, their trick, excuse me, just gets lucky through the wall and picks off Penny. And there's another one for Ange, who's lurked his way all the way up. Oxy had no idea. And the round has quickly fallen apart again here for G2. As Mad Lions looks to put number nine on the board, but that's an accepted number. We all know that. Stop. What? Are you Don't. saying that didn't happen already this game? Because we're not giving anybody any free shout outs, although I did give a fast food restaurant one just a second ago. Um, now you just have to shout yeah. out all the other fast food restaurants to equalize. One enemy all of them. Remains. Always. <laughs> no. <laughs> pass. Hard pass. All right, Whippy. I mean, it's going to be tough. It was a 1v5. He's just trying to stay alive, but it is not going to be. Nine rounds for Mad Look at the ult right now they have for the other side, though. There's the nade going out. That nade could be huge. Look at the way it segments them. You've got Dapper coming around the corner now alone, and I don't think they were prepared for this. Dapper just full W. He never once slowed down, and the utility is piling up, but Blackheart manages to spray two through the Viper ult, but it'll all be up Dapper, or to Blackheart, excuse me, and it will be the second round through fruition. 10 HP is where the Harvard lands as he jumps away. Yeah, I'm going to let you solo cast for a bit to make up for all of your <laughs> lost time. So you can continue, please. Yeah, I'm here for it. Listen, this is Go this on. is where I got my start here in the solo cast. As Oxy gets dealt with on the flank, that's not the person you wanted to go down next. G2 still fighting for their 9 at 3 half. And they're expecting a hit out towards that B site. Left. Two of three defenders. Or out that way. It's only Dapper just around the corner. Meanwhile, Bjor. Oh, never mind. They've got the right bye read. Bye. Dapper's done enough just sitting here. The snake in the grass as he rotates, though. Bjor deal with him. Yes, he does. Dapper tries to leap away. It's not going to be enough. Meanwhile, Shazam needs to hold down the 40. Found his one, but needs to find some more. The spike is falling. The teleports are taken. The shots are through the wall. And the half is 10 to Oxy. Out on the front foot. This is what works for G2. Get Oxy into the mix. And the rest will come to fruition. Narrate, oh, just can't sneak away. It looked like he thought he was out. He tried to turn around and eventually will get punished for it. Bjor 
Gonna kill on the back side. Oxy goes down, but the trades are good. Move is up. Spike is down, and now there's only a. I've got your. There is seekers now from Kazam. Yeah, Madline's kind of just left guessing. They have to make plays like this where they put their body on the line for information and. Trick is the first sacrifice teleporter taken. Bjorn gonna be hearing all this. Oh my goodness, the cascade goes through. Bjorn able to reel in the shots. Snare right here. Try and put a pin in it as well. And with 14 seconds, Whippy in a really tough spot. Spotted himself, gonna go up top on the wall. The L shaped box, a player on the other side. And he's gonna take the fight from heaven and Mad Lion. And that's seemingly the G2 way. Or. Oh, what a losing counter Molly. Court. What a counter Molly on this transition. Cove gets broken immediately. They're getting a lot of damage trying to get into the site. And that is not a safe place to be. Shazam is able to find some refuge here. Backs Spike away. Down a. Last player standing. <laughs> what a round from Nary. Three kills from heaven position. Again, Mad's playing some Top nice sense. angles here to just kind of jiggle peek and get information to be able to back no off. My cart will slow down the long portion of the attack. Poison ore blocks off the hookah portion of the attack. Spy and now here comes the spam through from there right on the teleport. Two for one trade there. That's certainly going to favor Mad Lions. Found for Mad Lions, they just don't move. They just still give respect to the, the option that G2 can be playing on the opposite side of the map or be looking to rotate, and that's exactly the call. Sage Wall goes up, no push from you all. Flash on the other side, and the guns are starting to find kills here. Guardian in a spec the swamp. Shazam just around the corner from getting backstabbed, but he backs away in the corner perfectly. Yeah, it looks like G2 has this pretty much on lock at this point, just based on the Viper's bit, based on Shazam's positioning. Whippy catches Black Heart and pretty much ensures it now. Unless Ainge can pop off, he gets one. There's just not really much time left to do much more. So he will back down. And so G2 will hang around at least a little bit longer. They find a fifth round on the board. Obviously, they still have a ton of work to do to threaten an overtime. But first step accomplished, I guess you could say, on that long. Defense split to a piece. Still not really sure where to expect this attack to come from. I suggest you move! And here comes the dead call. Narrate, able to get one back. Reckoning and force the players. I, I mean, just all sorts of chaos here. Just dancing around, trying not to get stunned, but they're walking into the sight lines of G2. Blackheart has a resurrection, but there's just not a body really in a good spot to be res. Spam through the sky remaining. smoke, finds Blackheart eventually dead. It was just damage at first, but Shazam makes good on it. We'll close Spike out the planted. kill there. And Ainge is no stranger to 1v4s, also no stranger to a loss in a 1v4. Great counter smoke though from Bjorn. Oxy forces through it, gets stunned. This could be a problem. Oh. Wow, so huge there. Only gets one, no damage mitigated. As good damage from the rocket means Trick will find another. That smoked off and it's being watched right now by Blackheart, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he's jump peeking it. Slow orb goes down. 30 seconds And left. Mad Lion seem to have this figured out. Oh, what? That's, I mean, One enemy that's remaining. just Dapper doing Dapper things. Unfortunately, he stopped right there as Penny finds himself alone. A tall task here. Locking a snake fire. behind him. That of Ainge with the Viper's Pit. Two players now working their way through this spawn. Cove to keep him safe for now. Cover and concealment. Two players swing. One player goes down, but that's not enough for G2 and Mad Lions have done it. They scoop up their first win, their first series win. And it's again.